and welcome to another Unfiltered Gamer live stream. Today is Sunday evening and we're going to be playing some party games together. I'm Callie and I'm here with my friends Caleb. Hello. <laughs> Alicia. Hi. Max. How's it going everybody? And Michael will be joining us as well in just a few minutes as we play three very different but uh, quick and engaging party games. So we have Starlink from Blue Orange. We have Night of the Ninja from Brotherwise Games. And we have Visitor from Resonant. Here is the top down view of Starlink. And I'll just move this out of the way right now. And you can move those too. So we have the board, which like the night sky is a circle. Has a bunch of stars already um, populated on there. And you can see there, they're bigger stars and smaller stars, but in the game they all just count as one point that we can use, one star that we can use when building our constellation. We also have a deck of cards, a one minute timer here, and our, our telescope here, which will, if you can manage to get your constellation to fit within the telescope, you can score some extra points. So it encourages you to be a little more creative and constrained with uh, the stars that you're using. And of course the dry erase white markers, which show up really nicely on the dark uh, blue board. So to play the game, what one player will do is secretly draw a card. And I'll just show you for one example here, but the card will have uh, two words on it and a number of stars. So the two words you have to choose from then would be here, would be monkey and pen. And either one will be worth three points if you can manage to get someone else to guess that word within the time allotted as you draw out the constellation. So you'll, you'll, you'll make sure that's secret. When you're ready, you'll flip the timer. You'll start to draw directly on the board wherever you want. And uh, players will, take, will be able to have an opportunity to guess. So as soon as someone guesses, they'll grab the timer to show that they've guessed and they cannot guess again until someone else has guessed. And this helps space out the guesses and also makes you a little more careful about what you shout out because if you go with one word and you're like, oh no, I know it's this other word, you gotta wait for someone else and it gives other people a chance to, to guess that word as well. And then if someone manages to guess it, you go, yes, that's right. Uh, you'll flip the card over, you'll see how many stars you get, and you'll just take cards equal to the number of stars um, there. And then, what's the win condition here, Michael? Do you remember? Everybody plays twice, I believe. Everyone plays twice. Person with the uh, highest amount of stars wins. He's the best astronomer in the game. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to put this Somewhere down in the middle, bottom-ish. There we go. And who wants to start? Alicia, you've played before. Okay. Do you want to start? Sure. Okay. Here we go. Anyone there saying hi? Yeah, Skip and Jesse. And, uh... Hi, Skip. Hi, Jesse. Sir? Yeah, we got Serge up in hi, there. Hi, Serge. <laughs> Ready? Let's do it. Okay, here's the. Okay. Uh, you can just tell me if you need it. And flip. <laughs> All right, Elise is drawing something. Broom. Yes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's the very first guess. Two that, points plus. That looks more like a hand to me. <laughs> it fits in there. Yay! Yay! Three okay, so you get for each of us. So, so now you get additional points. Cards for each point. Yeah, three, and then, and two, then two plus up. All right, and now we'll have to, um, I guess, <laughs> wait for the timer <laughs> to go back. And I'll be next. So I'm gonna draw a card. Look at the two options on here. And 
Let's make sure Chewy shuffled these. That's pretty good. Are we supposed to write the name of it? Oh, yeah. Alicia, thing? go ahead and write Hi. Broom next to it. Because we're kind of building our, our map of constellations. So... Okay, this this one will be interesting. <laughs> okay, you guys ready? Ready with the timer? Do it. All right, here we go. Mushroom. Yes. Oh, wow. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Yay, Max, you saved me. All right. It was mushroom. All and right. now we can see, did I make it fit? I did. All right. Um, can they see it all right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, great. So we'll get four points each. So three here. And four there. Thank you. And I'm going to write the word mushroom. First, I was thinking like stool or something like that, but I'm like, I'm going on a limb. I thought someone would say like broccoli or something. I was oh, like, oh I was, no. I was thinking potion at first. Oh. Uh, potion bomb. Like it was upside box. down for me. Yeah. It was fully upside down on my end. <laughs> All right, you got one? Yes. All right, here we go. Start. Oh, man. Hurry. <laughs> okay. uh. mm. Mm. What else? I guess you could guess in the um. audience too. <laughs> Help us out. <laughs> um. How's it going, Josh? A okay. scooter. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> wow. I didn't even finish. <laughs> scooter. Hey. Okay. You don't Three need points. a lot of stars to, to make it. Let's see if it fit in there. It, yeah. does. Yes, it does. So four points. Nice. Ooh, scooter or bat. That's tough. That could be fun. That would have been a little easier. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I can't points. believe you, that you got that. <laughs> and now it will be. <laughs> yeah. I was right? like, how do I draw? Like, I, I have no like, idea. How do I draw wheels on yeah. that? <laughs> I was, I was like, maybe a jackhammer. Or something. And then I was like, the letter T. Yeah. I know, that's what I was thinking too. Like, what looks like a T? <laughs> right, you're up. So take the card from the yep. yep. Take it off from the deck. Top of the deck. Take a quick look and then a roll with it. Ready? Yeah. A heart. Yep. Oh! <laughs> okay, and then write heart next oh. to it. I don't even know how I'm guessing these. I don't know. <laughs> Does it we'll fit? It, it fits. fits. I was like almost going to guess. So three like points? Tulip. I don't know. <laughs> yes, three points. So you get two there, Max, and then three for Alicia. I think Alicia's the one to beat. <laughs> Dang. Card for you, Michael. All right. All right, Michael's up. All right. Go ahead. Hmm. Are those supposed to be connected? <laughs> We don't know. Oh, sorry. <laughs> a pool. No. Shield. No. A cock 
akin. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Check. <laughs> all right. This might be too big for here. That's oh. that's all right. Oh, two points. And two points each. So I was thinking one. a casket until you drew, until you drew. That's why I was. I remember it was, it was like, casket uh, or coffin. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. The one sad part about that was I couldn't actually see it, so you had lifted your. Hand. I literally thought casket when he first drew it, but I'm like, I, I don't know. Sometimes that's you right. gotta guess. Yeah. Did you like how I made three D as well. Yes, <laughs> that's what helped me that's, get it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Ready. Mm-hmm. Diamond. <laughs> uh, you guys are guessing. You figuring out on stream here. Anybody getting it before us? A fish. No. What is it? It's. I can't guess again. Um. Onion. Onion. No. <laughs> An octopus. Yes. Yay! <laughs> as soon as you heard that, you were like, ah, no. Uh, it's pretty similar to my brain. <laughs> Like around. Really yeah, I was thinking of onion when you pull it out. Because you're doing all the legs. Yeah. yeah. You know, or like when you pull it from like harvesting yeah, or whatever. It's a little yeah. onion you pull out of the ground. Uh -huh. Let's okay. see. Does it fit? It yes. Fits. Three points. Three points each. Mm. Get this. Mm. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. <clears throat> Alicia's still the one. Got the most points. The second round now. All right, ready. All right, what you got? What you got? What you got? Umbrella. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's probably too big, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's always oh, definitely too big. I was. I was like, I'm just gonna go for it because that's oh. the stars that I saw. <laughs> All right, an umbrella, three. All right. So there you go, thank, thank three you. and two. At first, I couldn't figure out what you're doing, and as soon as you start going down from the middle, I'm like, <laughs> I got. This. I thought it was like, gonna be a table at first, and mm -hmm. then I saw the triangle. Mm -hmm. Get that bachelor skip. That's all I got. Two of them. Hopefully yours are more Go useful than it. mine. Oh, yeah. It's coming. Graduation season is coming up. I got myself a folks. technical degree. That's what I got. <laughs> all right. Are you ready? Oh, you haven't looked at it. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Choices. Luckily, only two options. Usually, it's pretty easy to just go with one. Okay. <laughs> Looks like a scooter again. <laughs> um. Oh gosh. <laughs> a boat. <Okay>. Helicopter. <laughs> a bike. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. I, I, don't I don't know, but it looks like the scooter, so the next step up would be a bike. That's oh, why no. that's why I, that's why I looked at it and I was like, mmm. It looks like it fits. Okay. Yeah, it fits. Okay, you're in it. Barely. <laughs> Four points. Four no wonder I'm scoring no <laughs> points. You're drawing T's with a line attached. <laughs> it's a T with a triangle now. I'm right. like, how do I draw wheels on this? <laughs> That's where going bigger can be easier. For All sure. right, let's see what this is going to give me. <laughs> I don't like it you could have been a stair climber, too. <laughs> you ready? I'll yeah. go for an antenna next. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
Strawberry. <laughs> no. A gemstone. No. <laughs> a rose. No. A rock. <laughs> you guys are getting close. A, a diamond. Yep. Uh, <laughs> can't say getting close. You can't tell uh, us. I can't what say no on. clues. Just yes or no. A fish. <laughs> uh, maybe. Yeah. A boot. A boot. That's the thing that's what uh, he thought Caleb's was. What? And that's definitely going to be within the. You tiny drawers over there. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's your card for the. New one. The Star Destroyer. <laughs> bum, 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 ba -dum. I like okay. your thought process, Kip. You ready? Ready! That's really tiny. Arrow. A mask. Hmm. Oh. Mouse? Yes. Oh, what? what? I was going to get a cat next. Yeah. When someone did something. I knew it was some kind of animal, mm -hmm. but I saw You're small not body even and small tail. connecting it to the dots. Say, Am, that's, this is a dot right there. And that's a dot. And, no, and this is a the dot. dot was right here. No, there's two. No, there's, there's two, two there. Dots. Yeah. Right there. You have a choice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, let's see if it makes it in the middle. I don't think so. Uh, I think it's No, too it's too large. big. Yeah, I can do the tail. Mm -hmm. I thought you have mouse ears. I How could many... not tell from this angle. <laughs> How many points was it? I don't it? know. It's two points. Really? For a mouse? <laughs> a bus. Scooter got you more. Uh. <laughs> Just in California. Okay. Because well, that's harder to guess. That, I mean, that's it, according that's to the game. Yep, but we could yep, that's it. Play more. Count them all up, Alicia. One, two, Why me? All right, how many right. do y'all get? I have eight cards. Thirteen. 16. What'd you My, get? What'd you get? 28. Really? No, 11. <laughs> 17. 17 is our winner. 17 is 16. 16. He's got to re, re, recalculating yeah. his odds. 16. So 17, 16. 13. 13, 11, and 11, eight. And 7. 8, yeah. 8. I eight. almost okay. got Alicia. I almost got her. <laughs> almost one point away. So these are the roll cards. I just described them a little bit. Everyone's going to get a secret hidden roll, and we don't know what it is if we're on the blue team or the red team or purple, our own team, and just trying to survive. Um, we won't know who. Yeah, we won't know uh, who else is on our team, and we'll be playing some cards to through the different phases to like spy and gather information as well as uh, of course what, what ninjas do you know sneak around and assassinate <laughs> so we'll be doing that and playing tricks and then at the end everyone will reveal and we'll see who's left alive and the highest drinking member of that house and that team will will win that round be able to pick up one of these little star ninjas that has points on it first person to get to 10 points wins. And what's cool is uh, when you die, we have these little ninja tower kind of things here, ninja characters, and it has the phases on the back so you know when to play what cards, as well as it's kind of your indicator whether you're alive or someone has assassinated you. <laughs> you can't see me, but this is me, and you can't see Max, but this is Max. All right. Okay, everyone's gonna get their secret roll card. Look at it secretly. And then everyone's going to get, did you shuffle these already? I did not, yes. oh. but at least you did. Okay, great. And everyone's going to get three ninja cards. 
And we're actually going to do a little quick draft here to choose what ninja cards we want to keep. Everyone grab your three. So we'll look at our three cards. We'll choose one <coughs> to keep and pass the other ones on. Sometimes and information is more valuable than uh, killing people and mm -hmm, vice versa. Mm -hmm. Depend may depend on your role and also the numbers. So the, the type of card will indicate what phase it's going to be played in and the numbers will indicate what order in that phase that card is played. What's nice about the draft too is you kind of get some information about what cards other people might have. All right. I've got my three cards. Everyone's got their three cards? Yep. Okay. Ah. Do you want to um, do anything where we show our cards to the audience? No, or no? Get we'll, they'll get to see the reveal when we do at the end. All right. <clears throat> Everyone's going to look at their hand of cards. So we just went through the draft phase. And next, we're going to go to the spy phase. So anyone who would like to play a spy card may do so right now. Or more, if they have more. So I have one, I have a spy five, I'm going to place that out in front of me. But if someone has a lower number, they'll be able to play first. Spy, spy one. one. Spy one. Okay. okay. Uh, so spy one will go first. Max, you'll choose one player and be able to look secretly at their house card, which is their, whether they're going to be Can red or blue. Give me your card. That's it. And then that will be in the discard. And now spy five. Okay. I'm going to look at Max's card. Let's see what's going on over here. All right. And this will go to the discard. And that's it for the spy phase. Next, we'll do the mystic phase. Anyone who has a mystic card they'd like to play, it's optional. We'll play it down. All right, we have a Mystic 4 is going first. This one says, look at the house card and one ninja card of another player. Alicia. All right. So, <laughs> one. one or two? One. Is that, yeah, sure. <laughs> and he's going to get some secret information that <laughs> none of us have. Hey, Jason, welcome. Welcome, and Jason. Let me see nice yours. Nice to see you, Shane. <laughs> You saw mine, now I gotta see yours. <laughs> yeah, yeah. When ninja's trying to defeat the opposing hey, houses. Hey, I didn't choose this one. <laughs> Give me the other one. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. How's your morning going for you, Jason? <laughs> Gonna be random. <laughs> okay, and now these are in the discard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then we move on to the trickster phase. Anyone would like to play a trickster card. Go ahead and do so. Alicia! Okay. Ooh, this one's crazy. <laughs> Look, this is the shapeshifter. So the trickster is the phase where all the cards are a little different. And she's going to look at the house cards of two players. And then she's going to take them under the table and she can secretly swap them if she wants to. So there's an option there. And after that, those players can no longer look at their house, house card and check what they are. Callie and Max. <laughs> okay. She gets to look at them first, right? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. And she can choose and to switch And you can choose them. to swap. She goes on the table and secretly swaps them if she wants. <laughs> okay, and we cannot look at these. I have a minor dilemma with my hand. Uh oh. Minor? Yeah. Because the next mm. phase is the blind assassin. Nothing, Michael. <laughs> oh, two blind assassins. Well, yeah. that's okay. Um. 
I guess I can sacrifice myself for whoever is on my team that's better than me. Oh, do more blood. Okay, there's going to be a lot of killing here. A lot of assassination, <laughs> I mean. Well, so remember, if you kill me first, I can't play my four and six. Because <laughs> you have the higher value. That's what I was just about to ask. Which is why I purposely did this. Because if I didn't, you could choose any two people. And they're good. And now I might be a one, but I might also be a five. So if you kill me, I don't really care. And you don't it doesn't matter if you live or die in this game. It yeah. matters if the highest value mm -hmm. of your team survives. And also, There's a one and we a can two be on the same team. team. Yeah. yeah. You have don't no know. idea if he's on your team or not. Yeah, but I'm killing Mike and Alicia. Uh. <laughs> I hope you know what you're doing. <laughs> So I that was know. savage. <laughs> it might be. You might, have, you might have cost us the game. We've got it. two ninjas down. And now uh, we'll go to the shinobi phase. Anyone who'd like to play shinobi may do so. That's it. Okay. What's up, Caleb? I'm going to look at you, Max's card. You're going to choose a player. You're going to look at their house card. Then you're going to choose whether or not to kill them. So it gives you... You have to survive to the shinobi phase in order to play so this, we but it's a little the, more powerful. If we were on the same team, by the way, I could have looked at his, <gasps> so you might have just yep. killed me on the same team. <laughs> no, I now know who's, okay. who's on whose teams. <laughs> okay, and that's it. Now everyone's going to reveal their cards. We want to do it. Maybe dead people first? Okay. You're alone in. Okay. Okay, so uh, Alicia did swap us. Mm-hmm. Oh, Red survived. <laughs> Initially, me and you came over reds, and then she swapped it. So well, I had a 50 50 shot. I would have won either way. Why? I because had two kills. If he didn't kill me, yeah. I could have no, killed him. No, I mean, me. no matter what Caleb did, Callie would have won. Why? Because if he chose. If I chose to kill Caleb and Callie, then mm -hmm. it would have just been Max to survive. Yep. Mm. Which is what we should have done. Some type of, you know, some type of uh, deal. Uh, well, see, initially, I wonder I, if we need I to partner was. Uh, alter this deck based on the number of players. If That's what I'm, I'm might, not sure. It might be. 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 It Okay, so the winning players will get uh, to draw a random. Oh, uh oh. Okay. That's all right. I'll get it later. <laughs> a random ninja star, and I'll have a number two, three, or four on the back, and that's your points. We're trying to get to ten. So we usually play, you know, uh, about. No Four choice. rounds, five, maybe. No? Okay. That's right, yeah. Because, I mean, there's, right. there's things that can counter it. We still have yeah, two of the true. five. Yeah, And uh -huh. he, he killed me from stopping me from killing other other people. Yep. I was hoping that it would buy me a little bit of a trickster deal here. Or figured you might, might be on my team. I had no idea. I had no mm -hmm. information at all. So mm -hmm. I figured it was worth taking a gamble. Yeah, I figured I... I was gonna get rid of. Your objective was just to survive, though. You One of the places. Yeah. That was initially Callie's. But <laughs> we didn't know. I, even if I didn't switch them, if he, if Caleb was to look at Max's and sees that Max is on his team, he wouldn't have killed him. Yeah. But Callie would have still, still survived, so she would have still won. Unless Caleb had checked mine. Only, yeah. only because I was kicked out of the game, though. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. When I was mm -hmm. in the game. I had two kills. Mm -hmm. I had three actually. I had another. I had a blind ninja too. Uh, sorry, Shinobi. Shinobi. Okay. I had one shinobi one and two too. blind ninjas. And you're alive again. Pick that up. And then we'll get three ninja cards each. Start the round again with the draft. Oh, this would be great if it was a hand. <laughs> Oof. Okay. And then everyone 
I have three cards. Yep. Mm -hmm. And we'll move to the spy phase. Oh. <laughs> Am I the only one? <laughs> Hi guys! Oh no! Only Callie gets to look. I only to get some information here. All right, Alicia, let's go. Okay, and Caleb. All right. So that was spy one and spy five. Next up, we have the Mystic phase. So if there's any Mystic card you'd like to play, play them face up. Oh, no Alicia's going to give some information. You don't need to look at mine. <laughs> mm -hmm. Claiming to be the Sus. Ronin. Caleb. <laughs> it's just the house card? The house card and the ninja card. The third one. This one? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Alicia's getting some secret information there. <laughs> Is he sus? Oh. <laughs> All right. Okay, next we'll go to the trickster phase. Trickster. What's it do? I have two. I got one of them. Okay, so the tricksters, these ones are a little different. Oh, and Michael's oh. got two tricksters as well. Okay, we'll start with two, the great. I got the one. Oh, you have one. So I look at the house card of two players. I may secretly swap them, mm -hmm. and they may no longer look at the house cards. If you pick me, I'm going to reveal you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mike and Alicia. <laughs> okay, I'm going to reveal your character then. We don't know if they're swapped or not, and they can no longer look at their house card. But, like Michael said, other ways it could be revealed, and so on. Next, the two, the Grave Digger. Look at two discarded ninja cards and pick one. You may play it immediately or keep it in front of you to use later. So we just take the top two there. We got a lot of trickster cards this round. Yeah. <laughs> So I could play another trickster card. Yeah, so you could play the same one Max played, or you can play a spy, or a mystic, sorry. Okay. Yep. Um, Max and Michael. Okay. <laughs> There's Michael's house card and Max's house card. Their secret roles. Caleb's going to look at them secretly decide if he wants to swap them or not and return them to those players they may no longer look at their house cards we have lotus house which is blue and crane house which is red um fighting as well as as well as a wild card the odd player out the ronin who's just just tried to survive <laughs> Okay, return those cards. That one's the next three. What does this one say, Michael? Look at somebody's house card and I'm gonna reveal it. All right. You may reveal it, so you could choose not to now. Things may have changed. This is true. Hmm. <laughs> okay, it looks like he's, scary. he's a remaining hidden. Okay. Okay, that's three next. There's no four, so I'm five. Reveal myself mm -hmm. and take a play an honor from a player who has more than me. Why would you choose me? Because <laughs> you've swapped me, <laughs> and you did something to me last game too. Thank you. Oh, all right. Michael's got some points on the board now. That was a trickster phase. Are you holding phase. a grudge from the other day? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it was either you or Callie. <laughs> yeah. Um, and next is the blind assassin. 
Ooh. Okay, that's it. Michael's playing his two. Okay. So, Max goes first with the three. So, you gotta choose a player and remove Callie. them from the game. I'm going down. I don't even know what I am. Fucked. <laughs> Next four. Michael. Max. So, he can't use his other <laughs> assassin card. And now, finally, Alicia. <laughs> oh, why, a, why a two though? Brutal. I'm the two. I don't, I don't know what. The two doesn't matter. We gotta kill the one. Okay. Okay, that's it. These go here in the discard. Next is the Shinobi. <laughs> well, no, probably not happening for me. But you're you're, you're dead. Oh, I am dead. You're right. Sorry. <laughs> Caleb's going to have to take a peek at you and kill you, Alicia. Uh, I don't even choose. know what my card is. Yeah. It could be swapped. It might not be. And we killed her. <laughs> 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 okay. We reveal. And Caleb is the only one alive. <laughs> <laughs> you killed your ally. I thought oh, my God. <laughs> okay, so we had oh yeah, they, there's no top down. Remember, so this is great because I was, Michael knocked out Max. I just killed the Ronin. Cause... I was gonna, I was going to knock him out too with the Shinobi card, but you did it for me. If he okay. didn't kill me, I was gonna take you out because I knew what these guys were. So Caleb and I were Crane House, but I was the one, and they got me. Um, Alicia and Michael were both Lotus House Blue, so Alicia killed her ally accidentally, <laughs> and Max was just trying to survive, but he got two bloodthirsty, two blind assassin cards. The worst case scenario, I card. wasn't against you, though, because if it was th two blues and a Ronin here, no matter what, those were the reds. Exactly. And I'm trying to figure out what I did to you to have that mm. stolen from me. I didn't do anything to you. I, actually, I, didn't, I didn't reveal him on purpose because I wanted you guys to, to potentially kill him if he, was, uh, if he had higher numbers than me. If you think, yeah. yeah. To, you don't to, make him, to make people think you were a different character. No, because if I revealed him, why would they want to kill a Ronin? There's no point to it. You don't, you Besides don't giving lose. me points. Yeah. And he had no points, so. Yeah. I actually didn't swap We get you points guys. again. I thought <laughs> you were going to survive and you're the winner. I didn't even yeah, do anything well. with well. game. Oh. In addition to. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's in addition to. You don't, you can, so that's why attacking, because you knew at least one of us was blue. Right. Well, I mean, did you know either me or Max at any point? No. Oh. The cost to reveal yourself, I suppose. Okay, put your standees back up. We're all but, alive. Were you ever red? Mm-mm. At were the beginning? You? I was blue. The, what? Because... Uh -huh. She didn't have information. Thought... You gave me the spy card instead of keeping it. <laughs> Initially, me and you were allies. Because I took your card and Max's yeah. card. Um... Caleb switched our allegiance with Alicia. Yeah. I so When I saw their two cards, I knew exactly that you guys were both. <laughs> I didn't know if I red. was. Yeah. Another round. And we'll get, we have our secret roll now, and we're getting three ninja cards, which we will draft. three cards now and okay. and then we'll move to the spy phase if you have a spy card you'd like to play am I the only one with a spy card yes okay. looks like it all right let's see I'm 
going over here. <laughs> Put it back. Okay. Uh, that's the end of the spy phase. Now the mystic phase. We have a mystic card. Oh, oh, and I have one too. Okay. <laughs> oh, we have a lot. Four. <laughs> I'm gonna, Alicia I'm starts up. with one. Let me see yours, Callie. Okay. <laughs> Go for it. Uh. Then Caleb. Look at the house card and the ninja card. Michael. Which ninja card do you want? The one to my left. Your right. And the house card. Okay, then Alicia has three. Let me see Caleb's. <laughs> And which ninja card? This one. A lot of mystics here. Okay, I'm next. I, I'm definitely looking at Alicia. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Callie, let me see your set. Alright. This is the point in time where people figure out who they want to get rid of now. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Next, we're on to the trickster phase. Got some okay. tricksters going on here. We got two trickster cards, starting with Caleb. So I get to look at the two discarded ninja cards and pick one. They're both mystic, so. I'm going to not play this card. <laughs> I want to see Alicia's card. My, I thought you already saw it. Oh, no, that was I didn't Callie. see it. <laughs> and it said the house. And then the right? card, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, mine is Trollmaker. Look at another player's house co card. I may reveal it. Okay. I'm looking at Caleb. And I'm not going to reveal it. Okay, that's it. Next, we go to the blind assassin who has an assassin. Oh my gosh. Two. Whoa, a two. Very, very powerful. Do not kill me. We're probably on the same team. Good possibility. It's a very good possibility unless you're Ronan. I want Give Callie your... and Caleb. Alright, so we are out of the game now. And Michael is going to assassinate. I have to, don't I? Um... Can I choose not to? You can just kill all of us. <laughs> Both of us. And then you win. Yeah. <laughs> no, but do I... I guess I, I, have, Corey. I have to, don't I? I doesn't say May. So Shoot. some of them do say I May. I should have played only one of them. Alright, but either way, yeah, I have to blast both of you, unfortunately. I would have preferred to actually... Probably kill Does anyone nobody. have any counters? No. Nope. nope. Okay. Then. She, uh, well, yeah, there's Michael. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Michael's the only one left alive. Oh, crane. the crane. All okay. right. Now, like, unless you're Ronan, because I knew you two on the same team, and you didn't reveal. Oh, you didn't reveal him even though I, he was a. Uh, so I was. That would have I given was him afraid. Away. Yeah, that I would be outed. But <laughs> yeah, yeah but you were two. You're supposed that's to out true. yourself. Okay. Yeah. It's such a small game. As uh, when we play with more players, for sure, I would have done that. But yeah, well, you're not the one. So yeah, but I didn't know who it was. Ah. I had another shinobi, and I was going to take you out. Oh. <laughs> oh, I know you saw mine. 
I could have done, I could have done this though. The judge instantly kills anybody, and they can't stop me oh, in, in the trickster yeah. phase. Uh huh. But I thought that was a little too too much too mean. You yeah, can, I was you stuck with. Kind of, I had all you could kill kind cards. of change the deck too if you wanted to for fewer right. players. How's it going, uh, Terry? I go. You get one. Hey, Terry. How you hello, doing? hello, Terry. I'll be rooting for Max. Thank you. And you stole me. a star from me, so rude. I did. <laughs> I didn't do anything to you. You switched me. As the Ronin. You had already gotten, you got swapped already. I didn't, no, I didn't. switch you to the Ronin. I could have swapped no, I was I the didn't. Ronin. Oh. You, you didn't, didn't need, need it. it. You didn't swap me. Uh-uh. <laughs> nope. I wanted to make Michael sweat, so I just sat there and took his just because, but I didn't swap him. I like that Ronin. I was excited to play it for once. <laughs> Want to play a little bit of mind games. We're going until we get 10 points. Yeah. And the, the values and our range secret from ninja 2 to 4. Star. You get 3? Okay. Yep. Please, no more. I'm not what I am. All right. Oi. Oh, I don't want these. I'm tired of killing people. You take those. <laughs> ah. What? Okay. Yes. <laughs> I have nothing that kills people. <laughs> You're peaceful, Ninja. Well, I, every game I've had nothing but kill. Kill, yeah. I've, no, I've had no choice. Mm -hmm. Well, I've had one, but it was kill now or kill later. <laughs> okay, now we move on to the spy phase. Go ahead and place out your spy cards. Anyone? Only one. Yeah. All right. Then Max. Tally, let me see your house card. Go ahead. Take a look. I have what they call in the Yu-Gi-Oh world mirror force. <laughs> Don't know what that means. Good. <laughs> I do. All right. Next, we move to the mystic phase. Yes, mystic cards. Michael's the mystic ninja master. All right. Good. What the hell? I, I don't even know who I am. I make huh. sure you know okay. what you are. Um, we have our secret roll cards. We're either House Lotus, the blue, or House Crane, the Alicia. red. And there's one person who's Ronin just trying to survive. In a night of the Let me ninjas. See yours. Um, oh, it's okay. I don't care about your cards really. And do you need a card? Yeah. Yeah, I you're supposed just to. Just show me the top one. Yeah. Doesn't matter. I mean, it does. But I imagine they're all kill people forever. Okay, cool. That's nice. <laughs> Yeah, you kind of want to have a mix of all three of those yeah. cards, it feels like. How many, how many kills is dangerous? One. Uh -huh. You might okay. kill your allies. Next is the trickster phase. Now if I just any hang out and see what you guys do. If you would like to play, go ahead and do so. We'll start with Max with Which Gravedigger. Is, look at the two discarded ninja cards. Pick one. I play it immediately. Keep it in front of you. It's just, mis so. it's just mystic. Yep. So, Michael, let me see your house card. Sure. House card. Oh, house card. House and ninja. Yeah. And ninja? Mm-hmm. Okay. And then Alicia has spirit merchant. You can look at an honor token, not house card. Not a house card or honor oh, token. Oh, or honor. Okay. How's it going, Alex? <laughs> How's it going, Walter? And if she had How's one, she could swap Alex, an honor How you guys token. doing? Good evening, good evening. Welcome to uh, nin Night of the Ninja by Brotherwise. A social deduction slash pew pew ow ow game. Next is the Blind Assassin. <laughs> Go ahead and play. <laughs> For the way you were okay. holding those cards, Caleb, I thought you were going to drop all three. <laughs> and it's also dangerous playing the the cards if they're like if you're playing like the four or like the five mm -hmm. because you're they know now. that yeah. yeah they know you know if Callie wants to kill Alicia to these? stop her or Caleb to stop yeah. her or Which if Callie doesn't kill think? Alicia then is she's up on the block or maybe Caleb would be up on the block it's kind mm -hmm. of one of those like 
Well, I'm sure, Cal, you've seen other peop- other players' cards. Not this game. Oh, not this game. Uh, That's the problem with having yeah. too many kill cards. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go ahead and kill Alicia. Sorry. So that you can't use that one on me. And hope Caleb doesn't kill me. I'm going to get rid of Max. Oh. <laughs> Okay, that was left. that was the assassin. Next is Shinobi. Go ahead and play if anyone has one. I don't. Nope. I don't okay. have any, I told Just you I wasn't you. going to yeah. kill this game. At all. Is Caleb debating? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's okay. I mean, can't you, you look then? first before you kill with those cards? Yes, you can. With the Shinobi one. They're more powerful yes. than the Assassin. So if you, I, I know you like debate you, them you on how to kill me or not. You should just look at your I have two Shinobi <gasps> cards. <laughs> so Callie and Michael. Which one first? Yeah, Callie. it mattered. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. No! I play my <laughs> Mystic mo- Mirror Monk. Reveal this if a shinobi or blind assassin chooses to kill you. Kill them instead. Uh, oh no. <laughs> and now he can't target Michael. And now we go to the reveal phase. Cali wins. We both win. I'm the Ronin. Oh, see, Michael had blue. Oh. Good thing I didn't kill her. <laughs> no, my team wins. Oh. <laughs> All right, good card, good card. So Michael played the mastermind. Love it. So it's a reveal card during the reveal phase. If you're still alive during the reveal oh, phase, your house wins the round. I mean, the Ronin cannot win. Oh. Which is good because I have, I have a few ninja stars here, so... Probably a good call. <laughs> Michael, do you have 10 yet? I, no. No, I do not. We yeah, play I have a nice Shinobi. Another round. One more round, I think. Yeah, yeah. I think this will be it. Could be. Unless you guys take out me or Callie. <laughs> now we're going to be Callie more of a target, even though, <laughs> even if we're on people's team, probably. <laughs> what are Callie's stats for wins? 90%, Alicia 10%, everybody yeah. else 0%. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> no, it's, on honestly, game. it's more on like 50, party. 40, 0. On the occasion, me and Caleb get one, and Max isn't here enough to be part of the. Maybe for like bigger games. Days. Party games, it's way yeah, more, it's more have spread been a out. Bit crazy. Like call to adventure. <laughs> yeah, Caleb's been winning some games lately. I do better at those types of games. <laughs> and you won Promenade, right? I used to win all oh, of Oh, yeah, that game last night, too. Uh-huh. Yep. Here we go. I was like, I have a chance to win this, and I took it. All right. We're going. That's a funny card. Take the kill ones. <laughs> And another kill one. Michael's trying to be the peaceful ninja. No, I just I <laughs> did the, the last the first yeah. three games I played. I died every single time when I killed people. Mm-hmm. It does paint more of a target on you. Yes. <laughs> you didn't want the kill one, so I decided to make you happy. Yeah, I'll take all these. I don't think I'm even relevant in this game. No, I mean. I'm very important. <laughs> okay, let's do this. The spy phase. Spy phase. If you have a spy card, I don't. like to play it. I don't either. I don't. Nobody has a spy card? Nobody has a spy wow. card, I guess. All right. Next, the mystic cards. I have one. Okay, so Caleb's going to go first. Going to get some information. Um, Callie. Don't be voting for I Callie. I knew it. <laughs> yes. Okay, this one and le- left or right? Left. Okay. All right, Callie, you're up. Oh, yes. Nice. Mystic, I get to look at 
one house card and one ninja card. Mm. What about, uh, let's, make it let's go Max in your middle card. Me and the Caleb. middle. Huh? Caleb looked at me. I looked at Callie. You should look at mine. Okay. Oh, you got a good one? Yeah. I don't know. Who I look at last time? How about I look at... Let's look at Alicia and Callie. Okay. Which one first? We have zero points. What, how many points? How many, how many, I have three. You have no ninja stars? Yeah, I don't have any. No, I want to look at Callie and Caleb then. <laughs> 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 okay. Because he, he doesn't mind if you win. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. I'm yeah, gonna, gonna help you win. I wouldn't have played it if you looked at mine. I, uh, you play it then. I don't know. Thank you, Jesse. Okay. <laughs> I don't Team me. I just way. picked. Um. I just picked the people who were in, in first. You're in first. Okay. Yeah, I know. But you, well, no, we all have three, don't we? I have two. Yeah, okay, two. two, three, and three. So I picked okay. the next two people up highest. <laughs> next is the trickster phase. Who wants to play a trickster card? Mm. Okay, this is what kind of kind of makes up the game and the rules. I have a two. Yeah. Um, oh. I'm going to play my shapeshifter then. Okay. And I'm going to look at two players. Uh... Callie, let me see yours. Mm -hmm. I'm going to secretly maybe swap you guys. Dun, dun, dun. So Michael is taking my house card and Alicia's house card, possibly secretly swapping them, and we cannot look at these anymore the rest of the game. Caleb. Okay. I can look at two discarded ninja cards. Okay, so this would be discarded, so you get the choice of Mystic or Shapeshifter. Would they actually be discarded once we play them up here, or would it be the ones um, previously? I'm not sure if it was super clear. Because otherwise that card just lets you play one of A the... A Mystic, yeah. Usually. Uh, yeah. Unless there were no none played. You play it and discard it, or play and discard all the cards at the end of the phase yeah it doesn't specify mm -hmm. could use some more rules in this game as far as <laughs> what things do some of the things yeah there's a little FAQ but I don't think that's one of the questions on there mm. alright go for it only two <laughs> choices I'm gonna play the same card that Michael played yep <laughs> I want to see yours and Alicia's. Okay. <laughs> okay, here's mine. It literally I gotta remember if you see mine, because I'm going to reveal it. I gotta remember what I was originally. You're going to reveal yours? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. It might matter what Callie's is, though. Mm -hmm. For him? Yeah. I know, but that's why I'm like... Why are you taking mine? You could have taken it. Why would I want to look at? Why would I want to look at yours then if you're just going to reveal it anyway? That's why she said that. Why, you, why would you have not played that card if I were to have looked at your card? Because if you saw my card and saw that I was on the same team as you, then... But maybe I switched you to be on the same team as me. Oh. Maybe you don't want to reveal. Okay. Four is next. Spirit right. Merchant. So, we have to look at honor tokens. I did look at your card, remember? Mm -hmm. Do you have one? I don't have one, no. Oh. So I could just look at an honor token. Can, yeah. Just I have hand to... me a random honor token, Callie. Oh. One, two, three. <laughs> one. All right. <laughs> is that, it yeah. good stuff? That is all mine can do. <laughs> all mine are the Thanks. same. Oh. All mine are the same. <laughs> There we go. And now we will go to... So, Alicia stole one of my honor tokens. Now we'll go to the blind assassin. Okay. <laughs> Max has two assassin cards and Alicia has one. Max has the two, so he's going to go first and choose someone. 
Hmm. Michael. Ouch. Michael's out. Alicia's next. Callie. Alright. I'm out. No. Caleb. No. <laughs> so much ninja death. Next. Shinobi phase. Okay, only Max and Alicia are left in the game. <laughs> and Alicia has it. <laughs> Let me see your house. <laughs> I can tell you that it's not yours. <laughs> <laughs> he was uh, he put it over in token. <laughs> Only Alicia survived. And who were. was on her team? Michael was on her team. They were both the crane house. Michael and Alicia were on the same team. Alicia was the only one left alive. So she and Michael were able to win as house crane. Alicia Caleb killed me. I was the road in. The, to be. A uh, house is dishonored. <laughs> and I had a Shinobi card every uh, single one. round. <laughs> I had one to use as well. I didn't get a chance to. Um, and Michael revealed his four ninja stars. He got all three there. Put him over ten. Meaning Michael is the overall winner of the game. Yay. Which you won this game last time too, right? I Yes. Yes. <laughs> it's interesting how this is random, um, a little bit of random assignment as far as this goes. But, like, Alicia stole my four, so actually ended up, she ended up with more points than me. And oh, Michael, wow. <laughs> Michael stole from me, otherwise he wouldn't uh -huh. have won. I barely, yeah. I borrowed. <laughs> Ninjas borrow. Mm. Well, all right. Tell us what you think. <laughs> all right, so here's how the game works, all right? The kid and the alien are working together. The, kid, the alien is trying to uh, give the kid information that's going to allow the kid to uh, acknowledge and understand the passcode to enter into the alien's secret portal. The FBI, C, uh, CIA, and the DOA are also attempting to do the same thing. On the alien's turn, the alien is going to be giving out clues and hints throughout the game. But to begin, we're going to go ahead and first set it up. The first thing that's going to happen is uh, the visitor is going to look at their hand and reveal two cards uh, to make up the game's pass rule. Now, in order to do that, you're going to have to set it up. All right, so let me go ahead and find the setup okay. here really quick. So then take the visitor's roll card, now flip over two cards from the object deck, and place them face up near the force field. Uh, this one, right? Yep. Face up. Near the force field. Face up, face up. Yeah. Near the force field. Around here? Yep. Okay. Then you're going to go ahead and take uh, 14 cards from the object deck. All right. Once you've got your 14 cards, you're going to keep the seven of those cards in your hand and put seven of your choice in the bottom of the deck. Now, the ones you want to keep are going yeah. to be based on your rule. You're going to have to make a rule for this game. The rule could be, for instance, and here's a few examples, things that cost more than $50. So a telescope would be uh, uh, a, yeah. a pass, yeah. whereas a rock would be a fail. Mm -hmm. Or things that weigh more than 100 pounds, where both of these would be a fail. Things that contain a color red, things that existed before 1800, things that contain metal, things that fit inside a car, and so on and so forth. You choose any rule you want, it's up to you. And us as players are going to try and figure out your rule based on the cards that are going to be playing throughout the game. So think of a rule, then select seven cards in your hand. Are those just examples? These are or? examples. You can okay. use one of them if you'd like. Okay, I can look at these. Sure. They're okay. just. Ex I mean, it's it's a game where yeah. you just make up your own rule. It's not it really a big deal. Depends on what's there. Okay. Uh, things that contain water. Things that you can eat. Things that you can't eat. Um, then after that, you're going to classify the two cards that you flipped over. These cards will need to be classified in either one of the eight spaces on the inside of the board, meaning it passes, or face up on the outside of the board, meaning it fails. You can only have ever eight face-up cards inside and eight mm -hmm. face-up cards outside around the board to show whether it passes or fails the rule. The kid's going to take the roll card as well as they're going to take the marker. They're going to take seven cards. And they're going to put the trust token on your board there. So three, four, five, six, and seven cards. So anything that's given to you face down is going to be on your marker. We all have our own markers for face up and uh, face down. Um, and we're all going to also be getting seven cards as well. Three, four, five, six, and seven for the FBI. Uh, four, five, six, seven for the DOE. 
And then, of course, seven for the CIA. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Go ahead and pass these over. Oh, there you go. To Caleb. When the visitor is ready, they're going to begin with the agent starting to the left. Before the agent's first turn, you look at your hands, make your pass rules and whatnot, all that good stuff. And then on player's turns, you're going to be doing one of two things. For the agents, you're going to either test secretly a card from your hand. You'll ask Callie, does this card satisfy the rule? She will say yes or no. If she says yes, you can go ahead and um, put this card in your yes pile. And if she says no, you can put it in your no pile. And these are going to be secret cards that only you as an agent are going to see. Okay? Or you can try and prove the rule. To prove the rule, um, you're going to basically have uh, the alien flip over four random cards from this object deck. Then you're going to have to uh, decide what you think passes and what you think um, doesn't pass. So the alien is going to uh, place them secretly behind her board and determine whether they pass the rule or not. And if you're able to figure out if all of them either pass or don't, you win. So if they all don't pass and you say they all don't pass, you win. Or if they all pass and you say they all pass, you win. But you have to get every single one right. And there could be a combination of passes and fails from the deck. Then, of course, the kid has an option as well. The kid can predict. Um, and the, the prediction is predict up to three cards from your hand. So you can show, say, hey, th this doesn't pass. And then the visitor will say, you're right, it doesn't. And if you're right, you move up on this board. And you can keep pushing your luck. So you can say, this doesn't pass as well. And if you're right, you'll keep going up. But however, if you ever fail, so if you say it passes and it doesn't pass, you get nothing. So it's, it's an all or nothing, and you decide how many you want to try and push your luck with. So if you go for all three and you only get two, you don't move up at all. If you go for two and you get them both right, you'll move your marker twice in the board, and you'll get all the benefits that are provided on here. As you move on this board here, there's going to be additional powers you get. So if you get to the Trust 2 level, you're going to have uh, be able to pass the rule secretly. Uh, yeah, it says, kid may prove the pass rule instead of predicting cards. Oh, so you can prove it. You'll, you'll be able to do mm -hmm. what the agents do to win the game. So you have to be here in order to win the game. This one here says that the card the visitor classifies on her turn is face down for the kid, when normally she'd have to reveal it face up. Mm -hmm. And then the first card the kid predicts each on each of the turns is face down if you get over to here. And these all give you benefits. It's usually drawing cards from the deck because the kid usually doesn't draw, whereas the agents always do. And then up to here from five on up, agents will have to reveal a card um, uh, from either the pass or don't pass to give you the kid information. And then the alien is the other one. The alien is going to be able to choose and classify a card from your hand face up. You're only going to ever have those seven cards. Mm -hmm. If the kid is three or higher, then the, you choose a card from your hand and secretly show it to the kid and then classify it face down. So you'll classify it face down here or face down over there. The game is going to end when either the kid can prove the pass rule or one of the agents can prove the pass rule. If the agents do, uh, the agent will win. If the kid does, the kid and the alien will win. The other way the game ends is if Callie runs out of cards, in which case the kids lose the and the agents win. Okay. How's it going, Gary? Hello, Gary. And I believe the agents are all working together. When you're playing a four to six player game, for a four to six player game, the additional players play as agents. Each round, every agent has a turn, starting with the agent that the visitor has left. Each agent wants to crack the case and get promoted. If one of the agents successfully proves she knows the rule, that agent wins and all other players lose. Each agent can only look at the face down cards she has tested, not the other agents. Okay, so in, in usually in a three player game, it'd be different, but in a four player game, we're playing for ourselves. Hmm. Okay, and that's pretty much the idea of the game. Quick question: Is this rock or? Soul? It's whatever you want it to be. Oh. There's no, it's just a okay. picture. Gotcha. And one of those oh. goes on the board, right, Michael? It doesn't have no, to. No, she's going to pr she's going to choose whether or not these pass or fail the rule. If they fail the mm. rule, they stay out here. If they pass, they go in. Mm. All right, Kelly, do they pass or fail? Both cards pass the rule. Oh. Okay. Caleb's going to start. 
I'm going to secretly test the card from my hand. And I just say out loud? Uh, no, you, you're going to take it from him. Okay. So yeah, you give it to her. She looks at it. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to put it uh, face down in the pass area or, or the face up on, on the board, just soft, slight, slightly. No, not there. Not there. Like right on the side of the board. Yeah, yeah. Like it's on it, but it's not all the way on it. Okay. Just like, yeah, like so that. This would sure, be sure. pass. Pass no. is on it. Okay. Fail is off it. Okay. So it passes. Now, Caleb, take your marker and place it on the pass. Just to symbolize that. It's that card yours. Passes. Gotcha. Yep. And then I draw a new card. Yep. So you can take this deck here and put it on the other side for Caleb. Great. And you drop to seven. All right. And then it is Max's turn. So you're going to predict, most likely. You're going to play cards up you to three. You want to build a trust. <laughs> and you're going to reveal the mask, Callie, if they pass the rule or not. Or you're going to assume if they pass the rule or not, based on the knowledge you have. Hey, Gary, welcome so, to the stream, man. It's been a while. Do they pass the rule? No, 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 no. no. That's not how it works. Sorry. Did you give her three cards? I gave two. her two. No, no, you'll give none. Uh, sorry, you're going to, one at a time, flip it over and say whether, whether it's a pass mm -hmm. or a fail. Is that a pass or a fail, Max? Pass. Is he right? He's right. Okay, now do another one. Uh, uh, Go uh, here? Uh, no. Uh, uh. Okay. Do another one. Pass. You want to do another one? No. Okay. So you're going to stop. Callie will put them on the board face up. And Max will move his meeple two spaces to the right. And you'll draw four cards from the deck here. One, two, three, and four. Well, what do I get four when it says two? Oh, kid draws first, two, kid it. draws two. And then it's my turn. Gives you more options. And I will test. What is this? It's a pass. Mm -hmm. Pass, it's on the board. OK. But fail. Okay, now my turn. So our trust is not yet three. Okay. So I classify a card from my hand face up. Yeah, either off the board or on. Okay. Off is just, just like ours. It's slightly. Or, mm -hmm. yeah, you can slide like that or whatever. Okay. We miss you too, Gary. I'm putting this one down as a fail. Perfect. Okay. Now it's Caleb's turn. Passes. Oh no, you don't put them on. No, you put it next to the, She has, he has two markers. One for off the board, one for on. Oh. Does okay. that make sense? So you just stack them like that. Yep. And you can look at those whenever he wants. Next is Max. Are you going to predict? And reveal. Does it pass? You're saying it passes? Yeah. Yes. And I'll just leave it at that one for now. So, two cards? Yep. However, I'm going to try and prove your rule. <laughs> Reveal four cards. I believe that's from, how it works, right? From here? Or from here, right? Yeah, from okay. the deck. Yeah. Um, they go yeah. here? You should have right, no, out to the south there, yeah. And what you're going to do is you're you're going to have to do, show if they pass or fail on your board. So the mm -hmm. ones that are farther farther up pass, and the ones that are farther down do not pass. And based okay. on this order, from, from far left will be on your far left, yeah. and your, the far right will be on your far right. Okay. I got it. I think, I think they all pass. You think they all pass? I think they all pass. Okay. Reveal. Okay, two did not pass. The dog and the broccoli or whatever those two in the middle do not pass. So these are going to go up on the board, and these will stay off. And the kid is going to get plus two trust. Mm-hmm. 
And you'll draw three cards. Yep. And then agent reveals one card. Do I choose the Yeah, agent? you choose an agent's card to reveal. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go with the FBI. Okay, Alicia's turn. Oh, I know what it is now. <laughs> Do you? Yes. <laughs> that passes. Okay, Caleb, are you going to try to prove the rule <laughs> or get more information? Try to prove... That's me, okay. Gary. Gonna do four cards again. We'll put these over here. And these go here. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna make a notation. And Caleb's going to try to prove the rule. Okay. Okay. Oh. So I'll pass. <laughs> 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 so, what happens when we run out of room on the board, Michael? You put on top. So okay. On what? It's on here. Put it on top. Oh, hide them up. Yep. Okay. You're only allowed eight face up in each category. Face up, pass, face down, fail. Face up, fail. Mm -hmm. Oh, for me? No. Ooh. <laughs> that was pretty good. Uh, Max's turn. The kid. Come on. Okay. So if I go to prove what your rule is, do I just say what it is? No. No, you're gonna. You we're gonna draw the thing. same thing. Yeah. We're gonna draw four cards. All right. Did he? Did you? Fail is that what the, you want to do? Did you fail as well? All four yeah. were right. I only got two right. So did you move up on the track two? Oh no. Oh. Two okay. more cards for him. And you can reveal two cards that were face down from agents, but there are none. Oh, there are. There's, there's, there's those. Yep. Reveal, reveal two cards you'd like. Let me see both of the CIA cards. I mean, I have to place them. Yep. Okay. Okay. You gonna try and prove it? Yeah. Four cards. These are the ones. And I will secretly ready? Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Only one passes. Yeah. I got this though. Okay. <laughs> And I have to, oh no, there's not eight yet. Okay, good. All right. All right. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna solve. Okay. Reveal four. You just put them over here. Sure. Okay. This is the only one that passes the rule. Um, two pass and two fail. Which two? These, these both this, pass. That this passes. This, these two pass. Yeah. Hmm. Really. Mm-hmm. All right. You gain two more trust, kid. <laughs> Then you may <laughs> prove the pass rule after predicting cards, though. All right. 
right. Um, but not right now. It's at Alicia's turn. Oh, you're not going to try to prove? No. Well, no, I okay. need to reveal one card, too. So the Dio, the DOE card is revealed. All right, my turn. Secretly classify a card from your hand face down for the kid. No. Oh. Hmm. So for the secretly one. Looks just like us. Oh, yeah. Here we go. On the board is your token. Off the board is his. You can look at that one. Mm -hmm. Caleb's turn. I'm going to try to guess. You can try to prove it again. Okay, let's do it over <laughs> here then. Did you get? Mm -hmm. They all passed. They all passed. <laughs> <laughs> that was the easy one. <laughs> all right. All right, let's okay. go to prove it. <laughs> Come on, somebody got to get it. <laughs> I understand what it is now. I know it was. I was just off by one thing. I think. Yeah. I mean, I was off by one when I. Okay, did wait, mines. wait a second for me to get the. All right. Hmm. Sure, you know how to get it yourself. <laughs> Got the. Those two. No. Mm. This one passes as well. I keep I'm, I'm always that yeah. one off cuz it's Yeah. All right. It Give it to me. Right. It's time it's time to end this. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to end this. Okay, Michael, you ready? Yep. Put him right here. That's it. <laughs> One second. Let me see that one quick. Yeah, I'm good. Michael got it. Yeah. What's the rule? The rule, rule is it's non manufactured organ organics. It's non made organics. Is made by human or not made by human? Mm. <laughs> Wait, then how does that one that hmm? you gave me? This is not made by human. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Technically, yes. I mean, like, physically made by human. Technically, yes. <laughs> no, I mean. <laughs> if it's made Nature. by a human, okay. Yeah. Well, I, I was like. Non-manufactured organics, I guess, <laughs> would be in the not passing. So any ma any manufactured non-organic was kind of what I was thinking. Uh -huh. But at first, I just thought it was organic versus non-organic. Uh, yeah, that's why you did the <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm like, pie. It's pie. Why is that not organic? But I passed the other food, the coffee. I mean, Jeez. and the yeah. Yeah, there was, yeah, but I thought that was because it was like. Um, in a cup. Yeah, there, yeah. Was, there was a manufactured aspect to it. Uh -huh. Thank you guys for watching another Unfiltered Gamer live stream playthrough video. Uh, if you enjoyed this, you can join us live every Sunday evening on Facebook and Twitch at 6.30 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, and we'll play games, tons of different types of games too, not just party games. We play... Uh, Larger, bigger, deeper game, 
more strategy as well as games that are coming soon to kickstarter sometimes that's a lot of fun always get a sneak peek of what's coming out soon and check out our website unfilteredgamer.com tons of blog reviews as well and lots of good great content on there and if you're on youtube here go ahead and hit that like button and that subscribe and bell notification we greatly appreciate it you can check out all of our different review videos as well as playthrough and other video types uh, that's all i got and um uh, yeah any any shout outs anything say hi <laughs> no <laughs> all right thank you guys so much for watching and as always we look forward to seeing you guys, guys next time, time.